very first ever uh, Elimination Chamber match, but we call it the Chamber of Death match. No where secrets. six. Eh? No secrets. Exactly. We have six beasts going to be colliding for a chance at winning uh, the No Mercy Championship for the next month. So, King Cairo has an important match against the winner of tonight's main event. And we have more championship matches in store. Sergio Menendez and Lucha Estrella competing for the WCW and FPW Cruiserweight Championship. This is huge. This is a double title match, title for title. It's happening tonight. And speaking of championship matches, coming up next, ladies and gentlemen, for the Tornado Tag Team titles, we've got the granddaddies of wrestling and the night stars. One fall to a finish. Let's take you down right there, ladies and gentlemen, and check you how all of this transpired. And coming up next, as we had mentioned, you've seen from, the, from our teleprompters, it is now time for the FPW Tornado Tag Team Championships, where the granddaddies of wrestling, King Matrix, that takes up most of the, of the screen, with Stonewall Steve meeting up against Speedball Mike Bailey and Brandon the Wolfman Wolf. One fall to a finish, people. So let's get busy! Oh yeah. Oh my god. Why is the why is the why is the the, the girth over oh, overlapping the bell? <laughs> Holy shit. King Matrix. It's right now. This Drake was mixed with the 1970s pop. <laughs> <laughs> like Drake met mixed with Magnum PI. Mag <laughs> Magnum Drake. Ah. Magnum Drake. Oh my god, that's a good name. <laughs> Marry me, I'm single. I don't think I no. <laughs> I don't think I don't think King Matrix. Is, 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 is interested in dating like, customers. You like to try, okay? <laughs> they're just... <laughs> they're paying they're customers! Just, they're just throwing it out there to see what happens. <laughs> Best pay-per-view ever. We've only got started, but thank you very much for showing your love and your... and your compassion These for it. They are easily pleased. Whoa, 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 whoa! whoa. Really? What is on here? That was the most underwhelming jump I've ever seen in my life. Stonewall. Wait, why didn't he come out with King Matrix? Who's Stonewall? That is Vicious Jeremy and Decay Wyatt's Faja. <laughs> the man is 70 years old <laughs> and he's moving like he's friggin'. Yeah, he's moving like, well, he's, he's coming out like he just came from the office. You guys are like, you thought there was Pyro. He's got a nice frigging blazer, man. I mean, that's, yeah. that's gotta be worth at least. Oh, wow! He slid from one apron to the other just to get to that point. Those are very slick pants. <laughs> and nice Italian shirts. Whoa! For 70 years old, moving like he's frigging Patrick Swayze from Dirty Dancing. Nice, right. right. And hey, the belt actually fits around his waist with no girth overlapping. That is awesome. He's ungirthed. <laughs> Let the girth loose. There's love at girth sight. It's just... <laughs> All hail girth. Girth Brooks. Alright, yeah. the challengers, the night stars. Because they perform shooting star presses. <laughs> and they only come out at night, don't they? If you, if you see a shooting star in midday, there's a big problem. Holy shit. Mike Bailey, man, this guy, he, this guy is timeless. He's ageless. He still is the same guy as he was when he debuted at C4 back in 2010. And Brandon Wolf, 
very young man, 21, 22 years old, hailing from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Mm -hmm. Of course, the loading screen has to be there. The senators. <laughs> The or gladiators. Excuse me. Well, at first, I thought they were like the senators, like the Ottawa Sen. It's the Ottawa Sen's championship belt. <laughs> the referee shows off the belt. This is what it's all about. The Sen's belt. The, all the, belt. Sen's belt. the Sen's belt. The, the granddaddies. Holy the night shit. stars. <laughs> all right, here we go. Watch, really. Oh, by the way, the championship committee decided last minute to make this a best two out of three falls match for the tag titles. So this this should be very very interesting, peeps. Very disappointing. We'll see. That's just the way it is. The granddaddies of wrestling have been tag team champions again because Vicious Jeremy had to strip himself of the title due to what Player Uno, or should I say Evil Uno, had done a long while ago at the end of summer when Vicious Jeremy came back from his pilgrimage retreat, a two week long pilgrimage retreat. He gets himself thrown into a, into a, a wall of glass. All right, now apparently he's making a, he's doing a very good recovery. He's doing good, people. He's okay. He's, he's gonna he's gonna he's, he's gonna live through this. But he had to strip himself of the tag titles because no way will a seven year old man defend the tag team titles by himself. So what does he do? He gets his old comrade, King Matrix, a retired major from the Canadians Armed Forces. Holy shit! Speaking of which, King Major just launched the Wolfman like he weighed two pounds. Well, they say you can only trust someone as far as you can throw him. That's right, Scotty. Meanwhile, oh my goodness, the Wolfman just sweeped the tank off of his feet. And even though these guys are pretty small compared to the, compared to the King, aww. Uh, it's all about technique up on this point. It doesn't matter how big you are, how strong you are, it's how you use the ring. It's how you use your own momentum to topple over your opponent. Knife, beautiful knife edge shot, headlock, firmly in grasp, elbows king, but he still stands up. He is still standing, and all it takes is one headbutt and bam, the wolf goes down. Holy shit! That was nice. Nasty kick! Followed with another mean scary attack from so long, but that doesn't stop. Wow, the, the screen was flashing, Scott. It only means one thing. I think that I think that the speedball, Mike Bailey, he has a comeback in his in his kick pads. He has no sleeves, so <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna come back in the kick pad. Boom! Brutish swings from King Matrix do little to phase the Wolfman from this. Nice uppercut. Boom! Oh wow, nice drop kick there by Mike Bailey. Using his kick pads. And another stiff kick to the lower back of the seven year old Stonewall. Those walls are built to last a long time. Oh no! Alley-oop! Oh my god, I haven't seen an alley-oop in a long time. And it almost, that almost struck the referee. Uh, oh! <laughs> Jab! <laughs> this is a boxing match all of a sudden? Was... Ah. Slugfist USA! Holy shit! Good lord almighty. He gave him a thrashing. Oh no. What the... Oh, oh no. no, what could this possibly be? Fall away slam from the yes. top rope. That's intense right there. In the middle of the ring for the titles. Two and no. A near fall, ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen. You are watching live, ladies and gentlemen, from the THQ Arena 
here in Gatineau, Quebec, Canada. And this is